Hey, you guys have been asking me, like a ton of you have been asking me, can you make a gold basket? And here you go. I went to dollar store and I actually remembered. And this is from the dollar store. And it says wire basket. It's probably like for your bathroom. I'm not sure. So I picked that up at the dollar store. And then one of you guys sent me this ribbon. And I thought, oh my God, I'm so inspired to make something. So I was thinking, you know how hard it's going to be to do it because it has openings. You can't put nothing in there that'll hold a gift card. Or if I want to put in a pick, nothing like that. So I was just thinking, I'm going to go ahead and use the ribbon. Let me show you the name of the ribbon before I destroy it. In case you want to pick up your own. Why not use the ribbon? I was thinking, why not use the ribbon to um, weave it underneath? So that's exactly what I'm gonna do to see if that could hold um, some of the stuff I'm gonna put in here without coming out. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do that. And I wanna put it right in the middle. Oh my God, I need another glue gun glue stick. Let me go ahead and grab that. Okay. Let me put that in there. And let's see if we can do this. I want to bring it, I don't want to bring it around. You know, I could bring it around and then just glue it like that. Or I could weave it in. Let me see how that looks. I know this seems very hard. Right? I do have little ones of these I could put back if I need to put it back. But right now, I need to do it easier. Okay. I think this will be easier. What do you guys think? Weave it in there? So it'll be like two of them. And then we bring it like that. I don't think so, because look at how it's going to look. You know? I could do one and then bring it back in. Let's see how that looks. That's how probably wouldn't look cute. So I'm going to just do it. I wish I wouldn't have tried this. I just made a mess of my ribbon. But I'll put it all together in a minute. I'm just going to glue it onto the basket. So I'll do it like this, right? And then glue. Like so. And then I'll bring it down. I mean, maybe that was too high. That's okay because if it's too high, you can just remove the glue. It comes up right out. I feel like the basket is not like in a great angle, but we're going to make this work right now. Okay. That's cute. I'm going to do every couple of, every three. So if it goes in and out, I'm okay with that. Because it's not really secure, the basket. It's not really like, you know. Okay. 
Let's see. I want to bring it. I think that's cute. If I need to add another piece, I can. I think that'll look cute. It's just gonna have help me, you know. And then I'm gonna close it up right there. So that'll be the back of it. just measure the length I always use to make able cool I have enough for two bows so I'm just gonna cut a piece off use that one and then I'll put the other one away for another day okay so now let's keep going I'm gonna go ahead and put some either tissue in there or if I have white I do. shred paper. So I mean, I could do white, but I think I should do like a yellow. Since we are doing a gold theme, I think the yellow would be nice. Now let's see if it falls out. So see, that's why I was scared. I mean, it doesn't fall off from the sides now. It's from the bottom. So what can we put in the bottom so it won't fall off? I mean, I could put more ribbon, but I don't want to do that. So let me see if I could find something. Okay, so I literally just cut a circle from this piece of cardstock that I had, and I am going to just put a little dot. Of hot glue and hopefully it holds yeah okay so then we can put our shred paper I don't think a lot of it will fall afterwards how cute is this do you have another idea this you know say it down below not gonna put a ton, I'm just gonna put up to where the ribbon's at because I don't want it falling off. But I think that holds pretty good. Okay. So let's start adding uh, some stuff. So I wanted to make it like a, a crafting paper, um, not crafting paper, but a crafting basket. Because I went to the dollar store and I found some cute ideas. The first thing I'm adding are these stickers. How cute are these? So these are from the crafting square and you get 12 pieces, okay? I am adding these ABC stickers in the gold. I thought this would be perfect for this basket. How cute is that? That is perfect right there. Let me bring this more back for you guys. How cute is that? Okay. So we're trying to make it like a gold thing. I'm trying. I went to TJ Maxx and I picked up this happy birthday card. I thought it was so cute for this theme that I don't want to. I'm going to actually give it to her. I found it on sale for $2. So it's perfect. She can go ahead and, you know, give it to someone else, reuse it or whatever she likes. I thought it would be perfect for this um, idea, okay? Because it's gold. So 
I happened to go to the dollar store and look what I found. How cute is this? This is a little garbage can, which she can always, um, you know, when she is making her vinyl decals, she can use this as well. Put your pen in there, you know, and leave your vinyl in there. I thought this was cute. So that's going to go like that. Okay. I picked up some double stick tape. I thought this was great. That's going to go in here like so. I'm also going to give her this card that I made you guys. You just squeeze right here. And you open it here and you add the money there. So let me go ahead and show you really quick. All you're gonna do is put your money in here. Bring out the heart. And there you go. How cute is that? Did I guys show you? Did I show you? Or did I? <laughs> what was I not on camera? So I made this. Really simple to make. Inexpensive. You know, great for any crafter. If you guys make cards, I'm sure. You guys can make that easily. So how cool is that? I'm going to add this one as well. I want that to stay like so. I'm going to go ahead and add two more things. I found this in the section of the notebooks. How cute is this? I'm like, this has to be in here. You know? that's really good right there how cute is that so here you go you guys you have your gold basket i hope you guys like it you guys have been asking me to make one for a long time i just you know haven't had an idea it came to my head and i also picked up the gold pen from the dollar store i thought this would go great with the whole basket theme so what do you guys think i love it Let's go ahead and add a little bow and let's get ready to give it to someone. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. I'm using the Dollar Store bag. So you guys have sent me, thank you so much. Marianne, Ashley, always sending me bags. Everybody who's always sending me bags and ribbon, thank you so much. I'm gonna be careful with this one because I don't want this to move. I mean, if it moves, it moves. No, I don't want it to move. Okay. I kinda wanna move stuff around real quick. Okay, so I feel like it needs a little something to push it up front. I'm not sure what. Maybe like another item. So for now, I'm going to use a little bit of tissue and see if that'll help. Like I kind of wanted to push it up front. See, like that, that's perfect right there. So let's go ahead and put this back in. I'm like, I need something. I wasn't sure what it needed. We're gonna set it on the table. And we're gonna close this up. Okay, so you know how I'm like, it needs something, it needs something, I figured it out. I have this Ray Dunn hand sanitizer bottle so it has the bottle in there so you could bring it out add your hand favorite hand sanitizer this is going in there i'm like it needs something it needed a little gift man i hate when things just don't go as planned and how cool is that that is exactly what it needed 
you know how you're like it needs something but i wasn't sure and that's what it needed a little hand sanitizer bottle okay so we're gonna go ahead and bring it back and we're gonna do the same steps that we always do you guys tape it make sure you guys are using clear tape please it'll make the basket look nicer bring the basket up we're gonna fold it And I'm going to bring it as tight as I can. Why? Because I don't want it to be wrinkly. Okay, as tight as you can. Bring your tape. Close it up. How perfect is that? Okay. Bring your scissors. Turn it around. I'm happy I added that. Okay. We're gonna crunch it right at the top. Oh, I think it's gonna be so cute. Grab your ribbon. You measured it, you grabbed it. We're gonna put it the right way. Okay. Like so. You're gonna bring it out. And you're going to tie it as tight as you can. Sorry if you guys missed that. Okay. What we're going to do now is cut a third of this off. It's just a waste. Like that. We're going to go ahead and we are going to make a bow. Now we're gonna fluff the top up. And look how adorable this basket came out. Here you go. A cute, inexpensive basket. The only thing that was really expensive on this basket is the money I gave her, which you can also give as much as you want. I gave her $100. That way she can go buy something cute. But you can give whatever you want, you guys. You can give 20 bucks, $25. Um, you know whatever you like i think it came out super cute you guys have been asking me for a gold basket and here it is you have a gold basket everything is from the dollar store except the money and the hand sanitizer because i had that already and i'm like i know i have to add something so that's exactly what i added but i hope you guys like it let me know what you think your gold basket is here um any other suggestions you guys you know bring them to me i will make a list and eventually i will get to it and until next time bye you guys